Hi, Dan. We had to add some variables to your product, so I'm going to go ahead in the back end and go over them really quickly. Uh, first of all, when you have the inventory, you have to make sure that you have a stock quali uh, quantity so because we have enable stock management at the product level. We have to also add a quantity here. In total, there are three chinchillas in this section, and we had to also add what's called attributes. Um, we have attributes according to the age, so that will give the person um, what kind, how old, okay, we want a kit. Now, because there are variations in the colors, you have to just click add and then put uh, the name of it. We said color and uh, violet. This little, this is called a pipeline. It's just a little on the keyboard to divide these things up. So we have two colors of chinchillas, violet and ebony, and we want to make sure that that is visible on the product page and used for the variations. And we also have sexes. So these are all different things we have to add for the product attributes. So it's not just age, because otherwise they can't select the color or the gender. Um, okay, so this is all saved already. And then we're going to go down to the variations. And so in the variations, this is how you customize each um, critter here. We have the baby, this one's violet, and it's male. Okay, so that gives us one stock item. We have to make sure this uh, quantity is also selected. And the same thing with the other two. So we have one male. Okay, then we say, okay, this is the ebony male. And then we have the ebony female. And that gives us the actual animals on the front page. All right, so we're going to go back and we're going to try this out. And we have the kit selected. We have an ebony and we have a male and a female and we could choose. Okay. Um, the only thing is I noticed that uh, the photos are not actually turning into what the animals are. I'm going to have to look that up. I believe it's a problem with uh, WooCommerce. Uh, there might be a plugin where we can get this to change on, on the variables being clicked, but I'll look into that. If there's any more questions, please let me know.